Hey guys, so this is my Snapchat story. Probably not the one you're expecting because this is my story about how I don't like Snapchat. I downloaded it a couple of years ago. Kick the PJ was taken, obviously, so I signed up under the name Planet Kid and I just wanted to see what all the fuss was about. So I started using it. I was, I tweeted out my name and a bunch of you guys were sending me pictures and I was responding with really ridiculous things like pictures of clowns and donkeys and stuff like that and just like whatever random crap I could think of. And then after a night I deleted it because I just thought I don't get it. And then a couple of weeks ago uh, I tried it out again for the first time in the two years. So I re-downloaded it and I noticed that it had something called stories uh, which I'll come back to. My Snapchat is pretty broken to the point where I can't actually open what people are sending me. If you send me a Snapchat, within an hour or even a few minutes, it says it's already been read. So there goes like the interaction portion of it. I can't actually read and reply to you guys. Now, the other side of Snapchat is the story element, which in another video, I was actually praising this for so many reasons. I realized I don't actually like it for those reasons. Now, I'm someone that, who likes to take a lot of care and thought into what I create. So the thing I don't like about Snapchat, which was the thing that I said was so good about it, is that you take a photo and you post it and then within 24 hours it's gone. Forever. And I don't like that. I like when I put something that I like onto the internet, I like it to sit there indefinitely. It's that kind of quick thinking, take a photo, it's here, now it's not here. It's just something that I thought I liked, now I don't like. This isn't the most exciting video. I just wanted to talk, sit and talk a little bit about Snapchat. Maybe I'm still just using it wrong. Maybe I still just don't know how to use it. Um, I know that there are some users that do really good Snapchat stories, but for me, that's just like another app or another website for me to, I, I've got too, I'm, I'm in too many places at the minute. I like YouTube, Twitter and Instagram and a bit of Facebook for my Kick the PJ page on Facebook. That's really kind of the only websites I want to be being Kick the PJ on. And on Snapchat, I can't even be Kick the PJ. I'm Planet Kid. So my point is I'm done with Snapchat. <laughs> I'm no, I'm, I'm done with Snapchat. Goodbye. It was fun whilst it lasted. But after the first few days, the whole story aspect really lost its appeal on me. I thought I could get into it, but I just couldn't. Here are a few of my snaps from some of my stories that I saved to my phone. Enjoy. And so, if you want to follow me on the internet, uh, my name is Kick the PJ uh, on Twitter on Facebook and on Instagram. That is where you can find me. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.